We are in Barrytown. And Town. apparently you did some grinding. Uh, yes. So, to show, almost I all the people thing. are one job level away. Never fails. I don't need to mute my phone. Pull this off. In fact, uh, <laughs> give me a second. I'm going to plug in my phone. I'll turn off my phone as well. So we don't hear, you know. The best sound Still. effect ever? It doesn't work all the time. Well, when it, it only works work. most of the time. Okay. Now she can pick up here. So yeah. We did some grinding. Um, everybody is almost one job level away, so I'm actually going to switch around some jobs. But the important thing is this. I, I obtained a Twin Lance. Nice. As a matter of fact, I obtained three Twin Lances. <laughs> I think you have a problem. Uh, no, I wanted to gri grind jobs a tiny bit. And I just stole every time. I didn't like make sure to get the steal. I was just like, I'll steal once, and I just kept getting Twin Lances. My so, point stands. Yeah. Alright, we're going to switch Lana back to a Time Mage. Give her Mug. Because really, maybe Flea, but I'd rather more people steal. I hate, I hate when wizards mug you in the dark alleys. Yeah. They whack you with their healing staves. Don't give her that, by the way. Uh, that's because Ferris is still the Time Mage, so... It auto set her. No, I'm saying don't give her the healing safe if you're gonna mug. That means you're hitting the enemy and healing them when you do it. Hmm. Good point. I probably won't give her. Well, it shows they survived the mugging. That's true. That was the no. nicest mugger I've ever met. I actually feel better for him hitting me. Ferris is going <laughs> to take time magic because Ferris can use all time magic right now. That's good. Yeah, these are actually best things. Um, just optimize Lena real fast. Except this should be a poison rod. And this should be an open mantle. That's in check. And this is also in check. Okay. We're good to go. The other thing is I did obtain money. Which I'm going to go spend. About 15,000 gold. Uh, gold. On top of the two extra twin blades and... I have, like, a sword in my inventory that I don't know where it came from. Is it a great sword? Yes. You get it in Castle Ball when you're in the moat. Oh, there you go. All right. Um, mainly, I did want to get a gold helm for our... Samurai. Yeah, he doesn't need it. Too late. Is he wearing Crashman's helmet? Or Quickman's helmet? Kinda looks like that way, doesn't it? Yeah. Quickman's wearing his helmet. Oh, okay. Yeah. Even and though this game did come out afterwards. Yeah, but uh, Mega Man 2 came out in 19XX. Or 1990X, sorry, excuse me. Mega Man 2 came out after Medieval Japan, so, uh. And this game sure? is. That this game goes through time and space in many different ways, so. Mm, Who's to I say see. where Bart's helmet ends up? Okay, there we go. We are set. Back to boat. Maybe all of the coins he throws are actually quick boomerangs. That, that's that'd be great theory. because that means the money's coming back. No, he just bought $1 uh, quick boomerangs. <laughs> Uh, so it works. Just throws a thousand of them. I'm gonna consult the. That's not the world map. That's the menu. Right side of Xdeath's castle. Right. Just don't remember where that is in relation to Bowel Castle. To the right. And down. Um. But yeah, I grinded on art quite a bit. Oh, that's the other thing I didn't show. Um. I'm set for potions. Good. Because you can steal high potions from ob object art. So every time I didn't get a twin blade, I was getting a high potion. Also, I realized that we, uh, after watching another person's playthrough, we missed the cutscene that explains why uh, Bart's is afraid of fights. 
Yes, it's in his town. Yep, which is he was playing hide and seek, and he spent an entire night on a roof and couldn't get down. He actually almost fell off the roof. Whoops. Nope. Okay, we're good. I did sleep before coming out, right? Yes, I did. Okay. So, Barrier Castle. It's a great place. Tower. I hope you're ready for more grinding. <laughs> Not on stream. Then we are it? in a pickle because this is the only place that. Are we you can ready just... for fabulous prizes? Yeah. Also, uh, you're wrong. He can crime. That's true. He can crime and and meet castle. Which is perfect because we're stopping at meat castle. Whoops. Did you just blow up your stream? No. Wait, what did you ask? Did you just blow up your stream? Did I? For a second, it came back for me. Might have just been me. I dropped a couple frames. Um. Oh, that's right. You might want to move Ferris to the front line. No, Twin Blade. Twin Blade does not give back it, attack power. It's a throwing weapon. Twin Blade is a throwing weapon, right? Right, Loon? Yeah, it's a boomerang. But does it have boomerang properties? Like, does he attack from full strength at back row? Because I don't think he does. Hmm. Rather, she does, because that's Ferris. Sorry, Ferris. Right. Special lance that cuts enemies twice. Hmm. I mean... You can test this with signs by moving her to the front row and attacking the same enemy and seeing how it works out. True. Because it was doing about, what, 180 per hit? Something like that, yeah. Also, once uh, Bart gets the next level of Samurai, we'll probably switch to and Bart's. Good. Ah, oh, perfect. Well, actually, no. You should probably leave uh, Gloof oh. and Beastmaster yeah. to let him finish off. I guess it is not a boomerang. <laughs> ah, yes. Oh, it's a boomerang. It just doesn't have the long range attack. Oh, these things are really hard to hit. Well, it's just neon. It's the gas. <laughs> it has very bright, shiny eyes. It's not even nice. reactive. That's it's also noble, so I mean, yeah. take that in consideration, too. Yeah, there's there's Twin Blade. Twin Blade in action. When it actually hits both times. <laughs> oh, and through watching your stuff, Loon, I came to the dark realization that I have to do the Undersea Trench. Yes, you do. You uh, really do. I do. You do, but you don't care because you have time. You can hover. Yep. Did, did, that, uh, did that traveler bring his own moon? Yeah. Yeah, I did, then. Whoa, where did all my MP go? I switched to Time Mage. Yeah. You did. I didn't rest after switching to Time Mage, that's what it was. No, you didn't. It's okay. There's something you need to uh, save before you do in this very room, and then after that you can go use the tent. Is there a monster in your chest? There is. Good. It's going to wreck you unless you heal up to full before you open that chest. In like fact, it might wreck you anyway, because it's a jerk of a fight. <laughs> Alright. I'm going to assume it's just the other chest in this room. You would be correct. Okay. I hope you get the one that has two of them in it. Yeah, Monster attack. double the rewards. I hate you. Did you get double yellow dragon? Yeah, I did. Fantastic. So this fight is actually two different things that you can get. You either get two yellow dragons or a red dragon. You Which need is to better? Throw money. Throw money. This is this is no joke. You need to kill them fast or they will wreck you. Sounds it's like better. Plan. Honestly, I'd say yellow dragons are better because Wait. you can plan. Yes. Did you just capture it? Yep. Fantastic. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> and then uh, elemental blocked the only attack that went off. You probably I, don't have to throw money anymore. You can probably just beat the other one to death. So after spending, you know, 
15 minutes trying to catch a bear. You managed to do this on the first try? Well, I have an item that allows me to catch easier now. Or not go. Yeah. Okay. Also, the larger the monster it is, the easier it is to catch, because we have a larger window of opportunity. Oh, damn. Also, they're bigger, so you'd more likely to hit them with a lasso. It's not how it works, but yes. Also, uh, it, for, for those joining, it's been brought to my attention that my timeline in this game is a little fucked up. We probably won't be getting to meet Fort tonight, but we'll, we might see meet Fort at the very least. Ah, a blood sword. I don't think anybody in party can use the blood sword. Nope. Well, at least you got the money. Experience. Yeah, the reason funny. why I was kind of hoping you'd fight those guys is that uh, they have a decent chance of dropping a coral ring if you kill them. Uh, nice. That would be also known as really good. Uh, Granted, no. you could have crimed a uh, flame ring off of the red dragons and you got really lucky, but those guys are more liable to flat out murder you because they're jerks. Not the red dragons. Although, because it would be in a box, if you didn't like the outcome of the fight, you could escape and then reopen the box and fight them again. If you wanted to crime the system, so to speak, you could what steal if... from them and then run away, and then steal from them and then run away. Nobody the has same monster the same Hypothetical time time. infinite flame rings. You just got a Warhammer? Yeah. That's a lot of money. Good. My entire system is built off crime. Yeah, I can see that. Where the dream. Just adjusting Lena real fast, like. Uh, so that we have somebody with fleeing the party. You might want to have her not be equipped with a power armlet. Yeah, I fixed that. I'm a little bit behind. Yeah, no, no, it's understandable. Yep. Fossil lizard. You might also, might also want to heal Galuff because he's at a whopping 90 HP. Yeah, we fine. He has a dragon to throw at someone. Please don't throw the dragon at someone. Yeah, it'll be fine. You need that for this fight coming up. He is a whopping 2 HP now. He'll be fine. <laughs> By the way, is Bart still equipped with a wind slash? Uh, could be. I'm not really sure what the best auto weapon is, so I'll go through that. I think it's the Osafune would be the auto, but... We'll check yeah. that after the fight. That's a good point. Afterwards, I'd strongly suggest putting the Wind Slash because, you know, auto attack means that a uh, Wind Slash that hits everybody. And there are a lot of enemies here that don't like wind. So it looks like Ferris just, you know, twirls a drag dagger in her hand. Yeah, thief. God, a good like, fuck everything. I hate these guys. Good like 25 feet away from the guy and still down to them. Fuck it, just time magic. Yep. You can levels out the ass. Um, which I guess is understandable because another playthrough I was watching, they were level 20 before leaving the first world. That's a little yes. high. It depends on the team makeup, though. They might need to be that high in order to do stuff. I just think they don't. They didn't run away from any of the fights. It's potentially true. Yeah. Again, yeah, it matters the big how fighters, you... Teams that can afford to run away from things, or teams that choose not to run away from things. If they have, like, a summoner, then you just... You hold down the summon key and just keep walking. Yeah. Are there any treasures I should be looking out for outside the... the castles? The, the towers? Uh, no, you should just be good picking up... At, there's a gold hairpin in here that you need to get. That yeah, treasure is pretty straightforward here. There's this place good. with the whole foreground layer, it makes you think it's going to trick you, but it doesn't. I forgot that you told me to make sure I have the wind slash on. Not the Ashura, it's fine. the wind slash. Mm -hmm. Ah, the wind slash is pretty dinky, it's only a little bit stronger than the Ashura. True, but the big thing about it is that AoE property. Oh no. The level trigger. <laughs> it's okay, you only Don't have fall for his devious riddles. Here we see the party fighting three vintage TVs. I actually was more thinking that they looked like, you know, uh... No vintage TVs work. Repair the giant vending machine! They Gravity. look like Retro Future. Like, okay. they look like stuff on the Jetsons. Why does everybody have just the shittiest accuracy? What the fuck is happening? 
Also, yeah, Vinay is right. It, they're just gumball machines. Holy shit. What is wrong with my party? Um, you might be equipped with... Are they, these guys might have a natural elevation off for chance, and you just could be swinging very poorly. X-Death owns a vast collection of abnormally large normal appliances and household fixtures. Mirrors. All for a special inflation. I always think they look like parking meters. I can see that too. You have to put the money in in order to make sure that they go away. They kind of look like 1984 Big Brother screens saying we're Ooh, watching. Hey, good call. I'm going to just say before opening any chest in this place. Good call. There's another one in here that's mean. It's not for a while. That's though. a lot of money. That's a lot of thrown money. Mm hmm. Speaking of which, let's get a hammer. Do you sell another Warhammer? Yeah. Uh, if you had had a Berserker, I would have suggested um, creative ways of getting things via Titan, because the rare drop on Titan is the wow. Force Hammer, actually. This, this guy Not up Thor's front. Not the Force uh, Hammer, the Earth Hammer. Earth Hammer, the Guy Hammer. This guy up front has defense. Yes, he does. He's also got. Why did? Oh, I thought you hit release. Uh, by the way, comet goes right past reflect. By the way. Interesting. I'll have to remember that for uh, future bosses. Where are you? Golden. That does mean you can't reflect yourself and then hit yourself with a comet. Yeah, please don't actually do that. Feel free. I'm just gonna keep stealing Warhammers. Is that a rare steal? I don't think so. Okay. I, I'm not sure if Warhammers sell for too, too much, but I think they do. It's money. Also, I'm just gonna keep throwing money. Can't stop me. That Next gravitates stop, Scott back. <laughs> this is just going to be the uh, the opposite of last stream where I wouldn't do anything. <laughs> no, can't r throw money away. Look, Gilgamesh was a special case. What? I'm sorry, what the fuck just happened? What do you mean? You hit twice? Oh wait, no, you hurt yourself. <laughs> Why? Uh, do those guys have reflect on them? They do. Okay. I you, you mentioned it and I'm like, maybe it was reflect. <laughs> Maybe it was... Oh, are they Reflect Knights? I don't even read names. They're, they're Reflect Knights. They drop Reflect Rings, which is what oh. I've had to grind. Yeah, you. luckily for you, you don't have to worry about grinding on these guys because you can steal the uh, Reflect Rings, which you really, really want uh, from yep. the Reflect Mages and x Death Mead Castle. Yeah, I've heard. Meanwhile, I have to sit here at the bottom of... the. Uh, Barrier tower, just being like, "Oh, look at me! How many, how many of these things can I kill?" The answer is not enough. You need to talk to your buddy Count Von Count. Count, Count from uh, Sesame Street. Oh, oh, okay, got it. Understood. Sorry, that very confusing to me. Um, I haven't found a gold hairpin yet. I feel like I'm getting really close to the top. Yeah, it's close to the top. You'll yeah, get to a it's... point where you can have like a little bit of a route split. Go to the left. Right here, actually. Mm -hmm. Doesn't even care. Why are these three hanging out with one another? I don't know. The alien with the big badonkadonk. The uh, little gremlin holding a... Uh, Heal up before you open this That is a hunchback. That is an alien with a right angle in its spine. Heal up, heal up, heal up, heal up, heal up, heal up. Alright. <laughs> oh, they met in high school, got it. Maybe I shouldn't use high potions while around here. You have the money. Exactly. You right, happen what do we to got? notice how much money you have nice. now? By the way, newbie, what level are you? 22. My team is 25 in Barrier Tower. Thunder Rods. Nice! Funding. Actually, I guess my team is 255 in Barrier Tower, but we're not counting potions. So you got the yellow dragons twice? Yes. We're gonna use it. We're gonna break a rod on this. Hopefully sure. not a thunder rod. No. 
I mean, I stole a Thunder Rod, so... Wouldn't be a good idea, still. I'm going to snap this thing that you absorbed. Yeah, Breaking Rods isn't going to do jack here. You need to just make sure that Bart stays alive long enough to huck money twice. Mm. Possibly three times. Mm. Throw a dragon at Oh, by the way, uh, Bull might be dying soon. <laughs> there goes the <laughs> Uh, and you're a Ferris. bit behind. Yeah. Throw a high potion on Bart's. Save him. He's a, save the cheerleader. Save the world. Is that cheerleader outfit? No, I, sure. I got this. Do you? Yeah, the problem is under control. We solve it with capitalism. We're decent here at levels. This is a strategy. Well, Bart's getting ahead is never a bad idea. Also, I am... Advanced math magic. I am, yeah, you uh, did it. I am low on Phoenix Downs. Somebody remind me to buy some next time I'm in a town. It's fine. It's not like they cost a thousand gold each. <laughs> I had this brief moment of, why the fuck doesn't want to have a rod? Oh. Alright. So this is gold hairpin. It's a really important piece of equipment because it makes it so... All my spells cost half as much. That's pretty good. It's almost essential on the summoner, and just really good on any other spellcasting class. Luckily for you, time magic doesn't usually cost too much in the way of MP. Yeah, uh, but until the very, very end, and then it starts to be a little bit of a problem. Hey, you're back with the trio. Rusty axe, magnet. I don't know how much money I have. I'm gonna check after this and then stop throwing money. Start running for fights again. Okay, I'm. No, I think my money's fine. To an extent, I know I'm gonna need a ton of money down the line, but for now, I'm good. You're pretty much throwing away about a thousand gold a fight, but you're getting a lot of experience and stuff out of it. Isn't so... it a thousand gold per enemy? You're throwing away a lot of money. Let's just go with that. Yeah. I'm making it back, but we should probably. You're stop. gonna need to throw it for this next boss fight, by the way. Oh yeah, I know who's coming up here. So this guy is one of the biggest roadblocks for most people in this game. Because he's a giant jerk. I mean, Anamos. Behold, Atomo! Oh, well, bye, Lena. It's fine. She did what she needed to do. Okay. She took one for the team. Time magic right back at you. So, uh, this time, well, the mechanic here is that Anamos starts to fight, uh, murdering somebody. Uh, we're releasing a dragon, by the way. Um, yeah, darn right you are. Oh, damn! Did I mention he has a lot of health? Because he has a lot of health. Percentage anyway. damage. Love um, it. Atomos starts by killing somebody, and then we'll slowly pull them in. Uh, should I revive Lena before she goes in, or... Nope. Just, okay. Just kill him. Um, fortunately, no. You can that... probably rush him down before then... Now that he's released his if monster. A team, if you have a team that would need to take longer, you want to put someone deliberately near death or deliberately kill someone and then shuffle people around. Yeah. Uh, the, the other thing, thing is, you don't want to. Oh wow, nice hit by the way. You don't want to try to have play along the system because if Bart's gets knocked out, you lose your major source of damage. Right. The uh, the other thing of note, then we're gonna go into uh, newbie's other game corner for a moment. Oh boy. Atomos is actually a uh, raid boss in Final Fantasy XIV. It's several raid bosses. <laughs> uh, it's a raid boss and then a trash pull. Twice. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 11th of the Ancients and World of Darkness, both Final Fantasy III references. Yep. Um, those fights are actually interesting because those are huge 24-man fights. And when fighting it, you actually have, there's three Atom Atomoses, and you have to split the parties up three way, and uh, yep. th take them all out like pretty much at the same time, just about. 
He's also a really cool summon in Final Fantasy IX. Yep. Oh, he's a summon in IX? Yes, oh, wow. he is. That's cool. I like it. He does gravity, right? He does stuff. <laughs> it's just, he does stuff. He's also featured prominently in a really cool FMD. Oh, yeah, that's right. There are oh. actually very few summons in that game that you don't see in an FMV that are via summoner mixed summoner. Oh, Zizat is, uh... Oh, fuck. He's fine. Did you visit his castle, by the way? Zizat's? Yeah. Which was... Sir Gate Castle. Yes. And you got float? Yes. Okay. There, there was a whole half an episode doing that because I couldn't figure out the puzzle. Okay. <laughs> Look, I, I didn't realize there was a puzzle either. Yeah, Samurai is one of those classes that's more than a little broken. I was going to let that... It, it more or less did, but I was going to let that scene speak for itself for the most part. But yeah, Zizat kind of uh, sacrificed himself for us. And then we're going to knock out Galoof because he's in a blind rage right now. Well, one of his best buddies is... Um, yeah, I mean, like, understandably, gone. but... You gotta... You know... You gotta look at the big picture here. Mm -hmm. By the way, why is the dragon here? Who cares? We called it. It was on the boat. Watch this happen. They use the flammy drum. <laughs> yeah, no, they no, they do not have. Ah. They use the uh, hear you drum. Hold on, Booskaboos flute. <laughs> I never played the third one. You should. I know. And Gloof doesn't want to face the reality that his friend is dead. Did I just fine. use boat? Nope. No, you wait. You need to wait for him to be done, then you wait boat. <laughs> one of them, uh... I'm... This game does that a lot. I'm sitting on Not three boat reflect rings. Boat. And I am so, so furious. You only need yeah, three. so you're done. Yeah. You Wait, what? You can falls. get a free one. Oh. Yeah, when you go to Istory Falls, spoilers, by the way, later on in the game, uh, you get a fourth one. I'm going to leave now. Thank you. Yep. No Anytime. Actually, aren't there two re free reflect rings later on? I can only think of one. There's a potentially infinite number of free reflect rings if you crime knife them off the right people. <laughs> I unfortunately don't have the crime knife. The crime knife will be there by the time you must crime knife the right people. I mean, in theory. Now we got a cool boat. You should go to the village of more. Um, let me get uh, above the water. boat that sinks, it's great. And then we can figure out where that is. <laughs> the boat that sinks. Oh right, one is dead. We'll fix that in a bit. She's fine. Just go to the, if you go to the village of Moor, you'll be fine. She's just taking a nap. Where is the village of Moor? It's that place that's in the top left that's surrounded by mountains that you Remember have to. Remember that your map works underwater. It will tell you where the good places to service are. Yeah. 